Well, welcome back to the channel, Tony here. So today we're gonna do a quick little trip out to the Driftwood Vineyards. This is the estate winery. Uh, it's a sentimental place to me. I've done a lot of work out here. I've done a lot of contracting for Gary. I've done the, all the renovations, all the structures, um, the tasting room, the trellises, the pavilion, and quite a few other things. So it's been a while. So I'm, I'm going to go out there and check it out. I've been wanting to do a series of the Texas wineries. So I just grabbed the cameras, hopped on the bike, and we're going to head out there. We're on 1826. This heads out to Driftwood. And then from there, we're going to head up to the winery. Um, there's quite, quite a, it's a really nice winery. So I hope you guys enjoy the ride. So come along. Single-handed. Hey, Gary. Yeah. Tony. Uh huh. How's it going? Good. What have you been doing lately? Same old, same old. Just working away. Really? Boy, well, we just redid this. And then they put some cross. Oh, it looks good. Coated it, and then I did the lighting. Uh, I just finished putting all the lights in. But. Uh, I need to get a roof on the uh, on the deck over here at the bistro. Yeah. So you turned that into the bistro? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Cool. Yeah. It's been a while, so I thought I'd come out here and check it out and see how it was going. Oh, it's going <laughs> okay. good. All right. Well, I'll swing back around. So this uh, trellis that we're gonna approach right now, this was the original tasting room. So when I started working here, uh, all he had was this tasting room over here. So I built this trellis, and this is what he, where now is the bistro, and this is where he wants to put the cover on top. So yeah, this is the bistro, and this is the first trellis that I built. The original tasting room is here. Hello. Hi. Do you need anything? Are you just looking? I'm just. I built this way oh. back when, so I was just coming to check it out and see how it's how it's doing. Yep, it's beautiful. I love it in the summer when the greens are up there. It's so nice to provide some shade. It's beautiful. You did a good job. Thank you. Vines have taken over. So yeah, this is the very first trellis I ever built.
So now we'll go ahead and check out the new tasting room. So this building was renovated um, to be the new tasting room. So I did all the renovations to this building right here. Currently it's uh, at capacity, so I'm not gonna go in and wait in line to go in for tasting. So we'll just take a peek here, but I did the bar, um, the countertops, basically the pretty much the whole tasting room renovation. Uh, when he moved into this room over here. All the railings, um, ramps, pretty much everything. And then over here, we have the pavilion. And the pavilion I built um, myself and one other, me and Felipe Lobo. And we renovated this little building right here, which was the, um, it used to be like a barbecue area. So we re renovated that and then, so this pavilion, we poured the slab, we set it up. Uh, we had these trusses made and we craned them in. Uh, the columns are steel columns surrounded by stone. So those steel columns go down to the concrete and support the trusses. So this, this whole structure, uh, me and Felipe pretty much built this by ourselves. We had some heavy equipment to assist us, but yeah, it's been a while. Back in the day, you would say. And uh, anything you want to do over there, let me know. Well, it's, um, you did that. Yeah. Still really need a drawing for that. It's pretty I straightforward. I mean, yeah. you're just going to build it. I know. Well, if you're interested, uh, if you want to give me a bit on it, okay. I need to get it done. So once we've got a roof on it, I can put some swamp coolers and, and keep it pretty yeah. cool. But without a roof, the swamp coolers don't do any good. Oh, yeah. Cold air goes up, hot air comes in. How's the beast? 
doing really well. I have to come up here and get a bite to eat. I'm really good food, too. Cool. Yeah, no, yeah, if you're... Yeah, I'll, what I'll do is I'll, I'll come out one day where I can just look at everything and kind of yeah. brainstorm what, you know, really needs to be done. But anyway, uh, yeah, I'd, I'd like to get it started about two months ago or three months ago. Okay, well, <laughs> I'll come out, take a look at it. Okay, great. All right, thanks, thanks Johnny. Well, there you have it. So sometimes it's good to come out and rekindle old uh, friendship. So we'll see what comes of that. All right, so there you go. So we're gonna go ahead and wrap this video up here. I hope you enjoyed that little mini tour. Again, it was just a little quick little, hey, I just wanna go out there and see what Gary's up to um, and kind of tour the place. I'll probably redo it, um, do it a, a full on tour when I do my Hill Country Winery series. But that was a, a, a quick little, you know, look at some of my, my work, previous work that I've done before. And as you heard, he wants me to come back and, and build his bistro cover for him. So I'm interested in that. It's a real cool place and I really like it. And Gary's a super guy. So I think uh, I'm gonna have to kind of come out of retirement and go ahead and do that. Hopefully, we'll see. But if you like this video, you found that useful information or you just enjoyed that, give me a thumbs up. That really helps grow the channel. Consider subscribing that helps me out too and we'll catch you on the next one who knows what we'll we'll be doing we'll be doing something so we'll catch you then adios amigos